Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's Timur Kitson here and I hope you're all having a great day and welcome to my first ever Let's Play. And I am super excited. I'm so excited to finally be able to do a Let's Play for you guys. So here it is. I hope you <laughs> will like it. And I thought I would just give you guys a preview of my Sims before we start this so you could see what I'm gonna do and just tell you a bit about this let's play. Also, I'm recording on a new computer, so tell me about the sound settings, whether the game sound is too quiet or too loud, whether you can hear me. Also, I know the microphone is going to pick up some of my clicking with the mouse, so I'm sorry about that, but I hope you guys don't mind. So, here we have my sim, and I am obsessed with her. Is she not the cutest sim you have ever seen? So this is Honey Shaw and <laughs> she is adorable. Basically, I have thought of a bit of a backstory for her and she grew up in the countryside. Her family owned a huge horse stables and she grew up like riding horses every day, like going horse riding and just like working <laughs> at the stables and she's a bit of a country girl, but she wants to make a change in the world. <laughs> she cares about like our planet and like saving it from pollution and keeping like the rainforest alive and she's definitely a huge believer of animal rights as well. So she wants to make a change in the world. So for that she need decided she couldn't do that from living in the countryside. So she has decided to move into Stan My Shuno and <laughs> try to do something there. So we're going to be putting her in the political career because I think that's what she needs to do to be able to make a change in this sim world. And yeah, you might notice I have another sim in here as well. And I can show you him. This is Danny. And he, you might recognize him because he's actually the sim from the trailers of City Living. And this is like a Maxis created sim. I got him from the gallery because they put him, put him there. And he is going to be Honey's roommate. And they're not going to know each other. She like went online and found like like a little ad for someone looking for a roommate and she decided to give it a try so they have no they like they were just me for the first time in this part and they don't know each other and we're gonna see if they become friends or enemies or what's gonna happen but i am not going to be playing as danny i'm going to have danny in my household so they can live in the same apartment but i'm not going to be playing as him he can do whatever he wants <laughs> we're gonna give him a career and hope that he goes to work and then maybe we'll do like a few little things with him but but like mostly I'm not going to be clicking on his sim and playing as him so he can just do whatever his heart desires and we're just going to play as honey. So I just thought that would be kind of a cool thing since you can't really have roommates in the sims for city living I thought I would do it this way and just play as her but have this other sim living with her. So I thought I would show you guys her outfits. Oh, and yeah, she's using some CC. Just ignore that everything is new because it is the new computer and I have not gone through and clicked on every single piece of clothing. <laughs> she's using CC hair. I'm obsessed with this hair. Uh, if you guys want to know what it is, just ask me in the comments, but it's uh, it's not <laughs> new or anything, but I thought it suited her really well. And she's just using, oh, you can see here, it's by Nolan Sims. I forget what the hair is called, but that's the creator. And she's using uh, CC eyelashes, CC what is that lipstick and uh, then she has like a few really few cc clothes i just wanted to give her a nice hair so <laughs> i'm sorry if you guys don't like cc but it was okay so this is her main outfit and i always give my sims five everyday outfits because i don't like them wearing the same outfit all the time so yeah i, I wanted to give her a bit of a country vibe still i'm sure her character will evolve in the series but for now, she's still like new to the city and <laughs> she doesn't really know what to wear and how to be cool. So this is her second outfit. This is a CC swatch of these uh, tight jeans that came from Backyard Stuff Pack. And she has like red lifting and she's still really like girly and <laughs> cute, but she has a bit of a country vibe to her. And then her third outfit is this one. It's the new dress from City Living. Then we've got this one. Obviously, I had to put her in these, what are these called? Like 
pullovers. I don't know I don't know if I forget, but I thought <laughs> they were very countryish looking. And then we just gave her this outfit as well. And yeah, she's just a, like a very cute, friendly person. And those are her everyday outfits. And then I can show you her other outfits as well. There's her formal, her sportswear. Sorry about the mouth clicking. <laughs> her sleepwear. And this is uh, also a CC recolor of this dress. So it's a, there's a bunch of new colors for it because, like I said in my other video of reviewing the cast stuff, I wasn't really a huge fan of every, all the colors that came with this dress, but this dress is the one from the City Living. You can... Oh yeah, here are the recolors. I don't even know what I was looking at, but <laughs> here they are. And then her swimwear is just this cute little swimsuit. And we have given her the aspiration, <laughs> the new one from the expansion, which is called City Native, and I can just read what it says. It says, this sim is all about the city life. <laughs> well, she isn't yet, but she wants to be. And it gives her the bonus trait of home turf. And it says, these sims become happy when they're in their home neighborhood. And she's very ambitious because she wants to, like I said, make something of herself, like change the world. <laughs> or that's at least what she has in mind. And then she's also a really good person. She would never harm anyone, like people or animals or anything. And she just wants to, like, she wants the best for everyone. So I give her the trait of good. And then she's also a vegetarian because, I don't know, she thinks you can't love animals and eat them at the same time. <laughs> so she's a vegetarian. And yeah, this is this is my Sam. Tell me in the comments if you guys love her as much as I do because I think she is adorable. And I can just show you Danny's. This is the outfit that he's wearing the trailer. It's the one he had on. And then I gave him a few more outfits because I thought he could use more than just one. But we're going with the jacket theme on most of these. It's a new jumper from City Living. And this one. I really like this outfit as well. And I did change his facial features a tiny bit. You can't really tell. I just made his nose and lips a bit bit like different, but otherwise he looks the same. He's like the Harry Styles from the trailer <laughs> if you have seen him. And then I don't think I changed his formal wear. I did change his sports wear because I think he, when he grew up he was like really into sports and he was like competing with his school and he was like a sports star <laughs> kind of but now he doesn't really know what he wants to do with his career or if he wants to go into sports or what i think we're gonna put him in the social media career just because i think he could be a cool like internet personality but he does love basketball as well and his, his sleepwear we've got his party wear that came from <laughs> that he was already wearing this is from city living and then his swimwear, this is also what he was already wearing, so I don't know, just <laughs> it's pretty funny. But yeah, these are my sims. Like I said, I'm not going to be playing as Danny, I'm going to be playing as Honey. Yeah, I only decided to use one sim because it is my first let's play. And I did not want to go overboard and do multiple sims at once. I just wanted to start off easy and maybe we can expand the family later or in the future let's plays or challenges. I can try to play as more than just one sim. But as my first let's play, I thought we would just go with her. Just one sim. So let's just hop on right in <laughs> and this is my first let's play so i'm sorry if i seem a little bit nervous it's just i've never done let's play before i am super excited but <laughs> i'm just a bit nervous as well oh yeah you can see the lot traits there <laughs> here are the sims she's already giving danny this look like who are you <laughs> daddy's just <gasps> danny does not care so I'm also using a mouse and usually I use a touchpad on my laptop so if I don't know how to work this camera my apologies but here they are and we move them into the spice market area into one of the available apartments and I did give it a bit of a makeover I mostly used the money that they had left over to buy just like more like necessities but then I gave them a bit more money to just decorate the place because I felt like it was really plain looking and that would not be a fun environment to play in so sorry I cheated them like a few thousand more money but just for decorations so this is the kitchen it is not very pretty <laughs> It still has like all these really bad looking counters and like an old fridge and stove and hopefully no one's gonna get on fire. And the computer came with the, with the apartment, it was already in here. And then the TV was here as well, I just changed the couch and stuff. And then there's the little bathroom in here, I can put the walls down, it's like 
nothing big there's these pipes that you can't take out because this apartment needs tlc i think it's called some tender loving care or something like that so it's just the bathroom i did uh like upgrade the items a little bit to be not the crappiest ones because we had a bit left over money and then they have their own rooms and i have actually gone ahead and locked these rooms i think yes i locked them so only harry i mean daddy can access his room and only honey can go into her room because they don't really know each other and they're roommates so i thought they shouldn't really just be able to walk into <laughs> each other's room they should have some privacy so yeah here is Danny's room. Let's just put the walls down. This bed was already in here. That should be why this bug is really silly. Here's his trophies from when he was younger, a kid, a teenager. And then we gave him a guitar because I would like him maybe learn how to play the guitar. And then if we go this way, here is Honey's room. And I'll, I'll put the walls up so you can see. This bed was already in here. So was this bookshelf. <laughs> I put a little horse there as a reminder of where she came from. Oh god, I need to turn the screen. Here we go. I thought she could do some yoga. I thought that would fit her personality. Again, this should be a white curtain. It's really weird. That bug is weird. I don't get it. And yeah, it's just a basic room. I just thought that maybe they brought some stuff with them. But other, other than that, most of this stuff would already be in this apartment. But obviously, they would have some stuff that they brought with them. And then there's this little hallway that you use to go out on this little lovely little balcony. And I thought it was adorable. And hopefully Danny is going to help us pay rent. Hopefully he goes to work because, yeah, the rent in here, I don't know, about 500, I would say, a week. So <laughs> it's quite, quite a lot. And we have about this much money left after we bought all the stuff minus the decorations because <laughs> I wanted to leave them some money. I don't know. It's about the stuff we, about the amount of money we had left. But anyway, let's get right into gameplay here and i think we should probably meet our roommate let's see hopefully we're not like really good friends already uh where is it no they know each other oh yeah i forgot to show you let's let's show you the law trades which is new from city living needs tlc was already here this trade cannot be removed it says a great place to practice your handiness skills so it just means stuff breaks and <laughs> yeah I decided to give this place the haunted trait because I thought it would be pretty funny to live in a haunted apartment. <laughs> and then I also gave it the, I don't know how to pronounce this, convivial. And this is the spacious but intimate feel makes it easier to practice charisma, comedy and mischief to your heart's content. Because I thought she probably need charisma for her political career and I didn't want all the traits to be bad. So <laughs> I just gave it this one. But yeah, this is the apartment they started and in the future I'm sure either she will move out or they will move out together or we will see but they will probably move up in the world to like fashion district or uptown or something. We will see. But this is where we're starting. And yeah, I think we should definitely get to know her roommate because they did not know each other <laughs> before just now basically. But I mean, I think they'll get along. I don't know. Danny seems like a nice guy. She would definitely evangel evangelize vegetarian benefits. Oh, I was just gonna go watch the TV. Okay, never mind. But what I did want to do was get her a job. Which is job? This one. Join a career, please. Because I want to go to work tomorrow as soon as possible. <laughs> and we're going to put her in the politics career. And yeah, let's see. Critic is the other new one. There's the politician and then social media. But let's go with this one and we're gonna join as an activist which is great for her join a life of public service from from protesting against the unjust to gathering donations for good causes or even collecting the occasional bribe as a means to an end politics is always interesting and then career branches are politician and charity organizer we'll see what we'll go for but for now let's just put her in this career and she starts work tomorrow that's great and then oh Work assignment. Choose the course to support. Should Honey Shaw get a jump star and accept an assignment? Yes, we should totally do that. How do we do this? Click on your chim sim. <laughs> Choose political career. Okay, that's easy. But I was just gonna quickly give him a career as well so he can make us some money even though we're not gonna play as him. We'll just hope he goes to work. And yeah, I think we'll put him in the political career. I mean, no, not political. In the social media career. I think that would suit him if he can do that while he's playing the computer 
here we go social media media intern let's go okay from now we're not gonna play as him <laughs> okay they see oh okay whatever <laughs> he can decide if he wants to do that or not anyway let's choose a cause political career peak cause choose foundation for less mischief no sin left behind simoleons are everyone speak for the trees and world united i think we're gonna go with this one she's not like a tree hugger but i think we wanna go with that one because she really cares about the environment so i think that one would suit her <laughs> she's excited yes honey has chosen a cause to support are we supposed to do anything else no we've done that one okay um okay let's see her aspiration introduce self to someone in three different city neighborhoods give an apartment key to a friend and order th three times from food stalls okay let's stop let's stop talking to him we've talked to him enough <laughs> what i can protest in my own living room are you serious <laughs> wait let's do that what are you are you gonna do it there are you gonna go outside uh, yeah, you- who are you protesting to? Oh my god. That's pretty funny. Let's not do that. I love this painting. It is so cool. We came from city living. Maybe she can do a little yoga routine. Mind concentrating. Let's do that one. And while she's doing that, let's go look around the neighborhood. Okay, this side is where we want to go. I have played a little bit on my own with obviously a different sim but i have not seen everything at all i'm so excited oh, this place looks so amazing okay let me just look at this place this place is gorgeous i'm just i'm speechless <laughs> okay um i love this sim she's so cute i think honey could be friends with her and i love how the sims are just like walking around with food I think that's hilarious. Look at her. She is just classic vanilla cupcake. Cupcake. Okay. Where can I get one? And here. Oh, here's the basketball court. Was there someone? What is that? What are you wearing? I thought there were only supposed to be like creepy people coming out in the night. Are you a man? Naoki? What? Autonomy? Okay. That sounds like wannabe. <laughs> Why is she sad? Oh no, unheard, unnoticed <laughs> from protesting. What's the point of making a noise when no one else can hear it? I'm sorry, girl. Let's go protest over here. Can we do that? Yes, let's do that. Let's stop the yoga. Maybe some other people can join. I've actually never tried this before. And what is this? I think this is a produce stand. But there isn't anything that cool there. You can just buy food. What's this one? That looks like... Mexican food, maybe? I'm not really sure. Look at this bridge. Look at those cars. Oh, this world is beautiful. I'm so excited to be playing here. I feel so lucky. Oh my god. And I can't wait to explore all the other neighborhoods as well. Where's she going? Oh, what are you wearing? Okay, good. Oh, she's adorable. Can we take a picture of her? Oh, she looks pissed off. <laughs> Hopefully she doesn't get sad again. I need someone to like notice her. I think other people can join the protest. Oh god, she's allowed. I don't want her to be like some weird hippie though. Maybe she just doesn't really know how to fit in. <laughs> fit in inside my shoe now yet. Are you gonna do something? Are you gonna join? Are you gonna just watch it? <gasps> Yes, it's amazing. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Are you gonna join too? Oh my god, everyone wants to save the world. This is amazing. <laughs> I bet she's not gonna be happy. I mean, sad soon. We're making a real protest. Protest? Oh my god, I can't say that word. What are you? Oh, oh my god, did you go? What are you? You're disgusting. <laughs> oh, he's insane. Why is there really creeps like this in big cities? I mean, I live in a pretty big city. <laughs> I don't see like shirtless people walking around like that very often. Please don't join the protest. 
No, he doesn't look very happy. <gasps> Who are you? Oh, you look pretty. You also have food. Lily Fang. I don't want to stop the protest. <laughs> oh, she looks funny. Maybe we should get to know, like, this girl, Jasmine, after we're done with the protest. What does she do? Protest. Protest for speak for the trees. For the trees? Yes. I think they're pretty loud. To me they are. I don't know if you can even hear them in the recording. Tell me how this is going. Let's go see what Danny is doing. Where is the welcome wagon, by the way? Oh, he's just watching TV. Not surprised. <laughs> did I show you his traits? I don't think I did. Let's just look at them quickly. So he's like active, obviously, from loving to play basketball and from his growing up. He's outgoing and he's cheerful. So he has pretty nice traits. He seems like a nice guy and he also has the city native uh, aspiration. So he also has the home turf. But yeah, let's, we're not going to place him, we're just going to leave him alone. Oh, she's confident now. Making a difference. Everyone loves the feeling of having their voice heard. Yes, they do. Oh, she's going to go play basketball. Oh, where's she going now? Oh my gosh, she's going all over the place. No, we're not going to chat with... Oh, we're going to chat with you. Oh, yes. Who are you? Akira Kibo. Let's let's do a friendly. No, she would do a funny introduction because she's a bit awkward, I think. And I also want her to change change her outfit to we can go with this one. Oh, there's a weird bug which is leaving like where did that guy go? Like she's not there he is. She's gonna start running to him at some point and then he's gonna walk the other way and they're never gonna start talking to each other and it's a really Oh, he disappeared. Okay, that's a weird bug. <laughs> Change your outfit. Thank you. That was also a CC hair, by the way. Let's talk to... Yes, there is... Can we talk to you or are you gonna also, like, disappear on us? Can we talk to you? Like, look, she's not moving anywhere. Okay, we need to find a sim who's not moving. Who are you? Let's talk to you. Funny introduction. Okay, that worked. <laughs> I think she wants to meet some new people in the city and make lots of friends. Oh, she's actually coming here too. Oh, great plan. And she has a cupcake. Oh, I'm so jealous. Oh, no, don't leave. Don't leave. Funny introduction. Oh, she's leaving. It's just weird. Can I steal your cup? No, I can't steal your cupcake. <laughs> Let's talk to her. Is she an elder? Yeah, she is a cool pink eyeshadow girl. <laughs> Discuss world peace. Yes, definitely. Let's take that out of there. How are we doing? We're a bit hungry, actually. Oh my god. Look at this. London. You're a teenager? Teens can busk? I wonder if kids can do it. I doubt it. That looks cool. Should we do that? I don't, I don't know if that's really something she would do. Can we do the... Yes, let's do that. About veg vegetarianism, because she wants everyone to be a vegetarian to save the animals. Who's her? She? I think she's from the trailer as well. She's so pretty. Oh, and she's leaving. I don't know why this is so buggy. I think it's something to do with like the neighborhood. Let's see. Ritu agrees. Maybe vegetarianism isn't as intimidating as she thought. Ritu might just grab a bite to see what it's all about. Yes, girl, you should do that. Oh my god. Oh my god, she's wearing the CD hair. Don't like that. Let's talk to you. You're so cute. Can we talk to her? Yes, we can. Oh, she looks so sad. Why are you sad, Miko? Let's tell you a funny introduction. Maybe we can cheer you up. I think they could be good friends because she seems a bit quirky as well. And she's a bit awkward still. Doesn't really know how to fit in. Oh, let's try to cheer her up. Oh no, she's very sad. Oh no, what happened? I wish we could know what happened to her. <laughs> let's get to know her. I don't care about you anymore. You're too old to be our friend. We need to be cool. Oh no. Don't leave. Try to cheer up. Oh, 
She's such a nice sim. What? Did that not work out? Oh god, I don't think that worked out. No, she didn't like it. Oh. Is she in the same career? Because we could discuss work. <gasps> she is. Cool. Maybe she's an activist too. I don't see her as being like a super politician. Okay, let's go to the other side because you can't even see her face. <laughs> oh, I want to be friends with her. Miko, what? Miko Oyo. Ojo? I don't really know how to pronounce that. Okay, let's see if we can grab some food because everyone seems to be eating around here. Miko has listened to Hani's passionate remarks about the cause and is feeling inspired to take action. Congrats on successfully promoting the cause. That's great. That's exactly what we want to do. Let's see if we can grab some food. Oh, we can haggle? Who's the. Oh, that's cool. Oh, your hand's inside there, dude. Are you a dude or a woman? No, you're a woman. What are you doing? Are you just randomly like fixing around? Oh, that's cool. Can we get some prizes though? Yeah? Oh, yes. 25% off. Thank you, sir. Let's get some. Come on. Let's, let's get some food. I think you can hover over stuff to see if it's vegetarian friendly. There. Bean and cheese. No, thank you. Spinach wrap, wrapped veggie burrito and tomato wrap. Let's get the spinach one. That sounds really good. That makes me hungry. I don't think I've ever even had a burrito in my life. <laughs> Is that weird? We don't really eat that much Mexican food here in Finland. <laughs> oh, she looks happy. Oh, I think she's so cute. Honestly, I'm like obsessed with her. What do you guys think? Oh, she's here. Let's talk to you. Funny introduction. Oh, you're eating the same food. Are you vegetarian? Dominic Flyers. Oh, yes, we can finally talk to her. Let's see. Rally to the cause. Yes, we want to do that to everyone. Discuss world peace. That sounds like something she would do. Discuss their interests. It's getting nighttime soon. Did it work? Yes, it worked. Let's see if there's a festival coming to town anytime soon. I think you can see on this board here. No, you can't. There isn't anything. Where's Danny? Oh, he's on the computer. What are you doing? I don't even know. Well, we can't just hang out with him all the time because we don't even know him. So, oh my god, you're so cute. What are you wearing? You're wearing glasses and a beanie. That's cute. Maybe we should say hello to her. Or is it a him? I don't even know. <laughs> I can't tell. Honestly, I can't tell. And I don't even know. Akshara? Is that a guy or a girl name? I don't know. I'm sorry if I'm supposed to know that. <laughs> oh, she has pretty hair. She... No, she's not pregnant. She's just... Big. <laughs> not in a bad way. Let's do a friendly introduction. She really needs to go to the bathroom. Let's, is this a bathroom? Yes, it is. Hello. Oh, this city is so beautiful at like sunset. Look at, oh. Look at this, let's take a few pictures. Oh, look at the sunset. Oh my God, this is gorgeous. <laughs> I wanna just keep playing. I've already been recording for almost half an hour. This is not good. I wanna go to work. Maybe we'll just wait until tomorrow and then we'll quickly go to work or have like i think you can work from home so that's really cool what is this pretty tasty from eating food oh oh congratulations Hani has taken her first her first steps on her culinary journey through the city eating food from the city unlocks the ability to cook it there are 26 more recipes to learn get out and try more food oh that's so cool Card. Oh, okay. Danny is cooking some food, apparently. <laughs> we could have just gone home and eaten with him. <gasps> What's that? What's that? Someone just left their crap around. <laughs> There's like a plant in there and a pink frame. I want that. Oh, look for snow globes. Yes. We should get all the snow globes. I think they're so cute. Girl, are you okay in there? Yes, she's fine. What was this? What was this? Oh. Good sims love to bask in the positive emotions of other sims. What's cooking good looking? It smells great in the hallway. What are you cooking? And can I have some? I'm great company. 
I found one Yuma High snow globe. Oh, that's exciting. What are you doing? Are you going to throw some food away? Okay, you can do that. Let's go. Let's go look at the basketball court. Who are you? Matthias? Matthias? Bjord Bergson? Okay, I think we should go home. Let's go home. Oh my gosh, she's gonna put the trash on the floor. No, your beard. Bad girl. I can't even pull it. <laughs> she would not do that. She loves the environment. Oh, I made her do that. I guess you don't want to be disturbed. I'm sorry I wasn't home. It's not my fault Danny didn't let you in. Danny, you're just eating alone. What did you make? No, we cannot have hot dogs. Oh god. Let's uh what should we do? She just wants to watch the TV. Oh let's check the cost progress, whatever that means. If people want to save the trees with us, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. What else can we do? Just Go on vacation, no, web, browse, browse something. Honey has raised zero simoleons and has two sims registered supporters. Okay, I mean, that's not bad in her first day, I guess. What can we do out here? Just grill some food. She should like, oh my god, she should totally take a book and read what, she, what could she read. The Lord of the Swings, the first unicorn. I think she would read the first unicorn. No, it's a children's book. She doesn't care. She's gonna read it. Oh, Danny saw what does. Hello, good looking. These particles coming from his head is because of the convivial, convivial trait. Lot trait, it just means that he's learning charisma faster. What did we get? Fascinating facts from using the Simspedia. Okay. And let's go, let's go read out here. And I, she even has her own cute little chair. This is one of my favorite items from the pack. How cute is that chair? I think it's adorable. And yeah, I think she's just gonna finish reading her book out here and then she's gonna go to sleep. And I guess I'll just go through the night and we'll see you guys in the morning. Never mind, we're back. Apparently she was woken up by nosy neighbors. The blaring sounds from a neighbor's apartment are enough to inspire insomnia and anger. Oh no, what are they doing? They're just having like a fight in here? You wanna do yoga in the middle of the night? It's only 10 p.m. She would definitely knock politely. She would not pound on the door. She's a nice girl. She has manners. Her parents taught her some manners. Stop doing yoga, girl. Okay. Let's just go tell these neighbors that they need to stop their arguing so we can go to sleep. That is so loud. This face looks funny. Oh, oh, it's Raj. What were you doing? Oh, complain about loud noises. What are you going to do? No, I'm not going to chat with Danny. We're in the middle of something. Can we complain about the loud noises? Oh. He doesn't care? Hey, I live here too. I'm sorry your life is boring. Maybe you should go to the lounge and have some fun of your own. Are you serious? You're so rude. Oh my god, we're not going to be friends with him. Oh, you could just see him there quickly. Oh, his apartment's all empty. How can he be having fun in there? <laughs> He's like an old man. Yeah, I bet you're having fun. Okay. Be right back again in the morning. Oh my god. We're still sleeping. Oh, Luke was here. Oh, it's a blue ghost. This thing, like, made me not go super speed anymore. Oh, it seems like she cannot sleep through the night. Oh my god, look at that train. Oh, there's like a train stop right there, or is that like a subway? That's so cool. It doesn't seem to be working that well. Okay, so our place is haunted. So there was a ghost. Did he come? Oh, what's he doing? Is he going away? He's just gone? That's all that happened? Okay, that was super exciting. <laughs> I don't know. We've been woken up so many times now. I think I'm gonna leave this part here. This has been like over half an hour now, I think, if I, if my timer is correct. I will see you guys in the next episode when we will do her first day of work as, uh, what is she called? Uh, unruly activist. So we're gonna go to her first day of work and 
see what we can do to change the world <laughs> tomorrow. I thank you guys so much for watching this first part. I'm sorry it was a bit all over the place. I'm still new to this, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, because I do post Sims content very regularly and there will be a new part coming up maybe later this week. I do want to give get your guys's like feedback tell me what you thought about this what you want honey to do with her career what she could do in the city and if she, her and danny should become friends or enemies or what should happen if you have any ideas tell me in the comment i will reply to all the comments and thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you soon for a new video bye bye